The aim of this is to show you how to draw an age sex pyramid in order to present your questionnaire results. You need graph paper, a ruler, a pencil and your table of results. In order to decide upon your scale along the bottom of your graph you need to see which category has the highest result. For us it's the females aged 30 to 50 of which we found to be 26. We're going to draw a line where one centimetre equals two people. The females will be represented on the right hand side of the graph and the males on the left. So we're going to draw a line that's 26 centimetres in total along the bottom of your graph paper. Label on your scale, so as I said each centimetre equals two people, so you'll go up two, four, six, eight, ten, etc. On the right hand side you put your females label and on the left your males. In the centre of your graph, at the zero mark, you'll take at your y-axis, a vertical column, and draw it upwards for 10 centimetres, marking off every 2 centimetres. You are now ready to begin to draw your bar graphs. They go horizontally, as you will see, and for the 10 to 20 age group, there are no males, but we had one female. So we go down to our scale, and as one centimetre equals two people, then half a centimetre will equal one person. And you draw yourself a nice, neat, horizontal bar, as you can see. Then up to your next age group, the 20 to 30 age group. Here we had 10 males, so you draw your horizontal bar out to the 10 on the left hand side, up the 2 centimetres, and your females, we had 13 females, and I've drawn as you can see. Complete for all your age groups, and you should have a graph that looks something like this. And all graphs need a clear title, so add a title to your graph, and that's your first data presentation completed. Well done.